Good morning. Good morning, good morning, good morning. I have coffee. You can feel that it's getting colder and colder in the morning and darker and darker. But we shouldn't be afraid. No, we shouldn't fear the changes. And the leaf that I talked about yesterday is the perfect example for that. When I tapped into the energy today, there was still this energy of uncertainty, being confused, overthinking. Yeah. Repressing emotions, holding something back. But at the same time, we had to have more into it. The card that popped up in my mind was actually the High Priestess, which is perfect in the combination with overthinking or being confused or maybe even to the point of being distant or being cold, closing off the heart a little bit to protect it in a way. The High Priestess does come in with this energy of, well, I did he. I did hear, see, hear and sense. There is more knowledge coming. See, hear, sense. There is more knowledge coming. And it's also perfect because with the Queen of... With the Queen of uh, Swords, yes. Well, the Queen of Swords can be overthinker. But with the High Priestess, she does ask herself to quiet down the mental chatter and we create that right out of the confusion there is this like i almost want to say divine truth coming to you we did get that told yesterday there might be something that's just like it feels confusing it doesn't feel bad but it feels confusing like what is the reason of this and where do i go from here how can i solve this why is this happening, right? I mean, I feel in a lot of people's life, and it doesn't have to be bad, it doesn't have to be not fixable, but it's like, why is it happening, right? Um, and for someone out there, it could be bad. It could be. But you are being asked today to clear the mental clutter in this confusing confusion. <laughs> because whatever is happening is preparing you for something better bigger probably bigger than you think will it knock your socks off yes will it come unexpected probably are we prepared for that maybe <laughs> maybe not but we will in the moment yeah my nose is a little bit annoying so i'm taking some blowing my nose breaks <laughs> but I've been guided to take this today, to use this today, which is interesting because that it does show what happens behind the scenes. So I guess that is what we need. But something is happening behind the scenes that I might be quiet, <laughs> I might not be much guidance or much going on right now where you're like, I need an answer, I need to figure out what's happening, but there might just not really be anything. At the moment, you guys remember her? The first video I made. <laughs> uh, the first video I made. Okay. <laughs> what is happening right now? Um, the video I made some days ago with me feeling under the weather. That should have been a post, but then we got this and we got told that something will happen the next weeks, right? I love this image so much. Look at this. You get to see what's actually in front of the Two of Swords. And this you know, reminds me of the energy today. Being confused, not making a stand, and not making a decision. And if you look, there is this horse just waiting for her to open her eyes so that she can see your transportation is here, madam. 
If you are ready, I'm ready. Maybe that's what the universe is trying to tell you. If you are ready, I'm ready, but it means that you need to take the steps. Ooh. <laughs> that, that gave that gave the chills down the spine I heard for someone out there. It's like, ooh, oh, I didn't want to hear that. Your body your body reacted on it, so to speak. Okay, spirit. Well something is happening. Wow. Oh boy. Whoa. I mean some of you guys are being prepared to move or change jobs. Move forward. Making a decision. Let's just see. <laughs> You're walking off your path. You're walking off your path. You're being divinely guided. Like, it's not normally you to walk, or walk off the beaten path, but that is what you do. That is what you probably already have done. That's why the changes are happening, right? The sun, the happiest card in the tarot. I did hear, which is actually interesting with the high priestess. I saw her, so she's following her, uh, following us. So it's this energy of like, do not dig into the meaning of the cards. And, and I can feel that when I do readings, I'm being asked to go fully by intuition. The cards are just a guiding tool. It shouldn't be the primordial. <laughs> Whoa, what a word is that? Um, Guideline. <laughs> it doesn't want to focus on it. Oh, there you go. Fun times. You can be this child that <laughs> colors outside the the lines. Don't you know you don't need to be perfect, and there will be help coming your way. If it's money or help you need, whatever it is. People are, will rush in fast, and you also will know where to go. But there might be something that comes um, the next week that can help you. If it's like someone who helps you or gives you knowledge or the truth or whatever it is, something that can help you actually stay on track, or if it's money coming your way in one way or another, so that you can make these changes that you're looking for. Yeah. Some of you guys say something about money or something. Yeah. I mean, the Knight of Swords is a little bit scary here because you can see. But... The people are the fire. But you know what? I feel this is a person, actually. It could be someone with Capricorn or Libra in that chart. Obviously. We cannot forget that it is Era and it is Pentacles, so it could be a Gemini too, Taurus, Virgo. Could be someone who has a younger energy. Hmm. There you go. So today you're being asked to not break down to the mental chatter, quiet it down. And it's okay to go off the beaten path because that you are guided by the sheep, <laughs> by the raven, right? By the sun. I mean, everything is guiding you. No matter how wrong you step on your path right now, you will be put back on track. That's it, people. With that, I will get back. <laughs> we'll get back. I will get ready for my customer. Taking pictures in the new renovated studio. Exciting times. Remember to tune into the vlog on Friday if you want to know what happens. But I will see you guys tomorrow. Bye bye.